Hi, YouTubers and wet shavers everywhere. It's MargaretGeorgeTune.com. Merry Shave Mass, everybody. It's day one of the Phoenix Shaving 12 Shaves of Christmas Advent Calendar. We're opening up door number one. Happy December 14th. We're kicking it off by opening up door number one. What do we have there? Is it going to be ghosts of shaving past or shaves of the future? <laughs> shaves yet to come. Let's check it out right here. A little bit of a perforation right here. We're going to go ahead and punch that over. Punch that open and then pull this open and open it up. Oh my gosh, what do we got here? Oh, ho, 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 ho. let's check it out. And what do we have here? This is, ooh, here we go. We've got some information also with it. Oh, this is great. This is absolutely great. Check it out. Let's set that aside. And here we have Holiday Hinoki and White Sage. Check that out right there. Let me just put that there like that. Holiday Hinoki and White Sage. Wow. <laughs> That's absolutely fantastic. Check out that artwork right there. Okay, what do we have here? It says here, uh, the scent profile. Uh, white pepper, wh white peppercorn, uh, clove bud, cypress needle, cedar bark, birch wood, Siberian pine, warm amber, uh, what's this, crushed moss, vanilla bean. My gosh. <laughs> Absolutely fantastic. Here, I'll let you get a screenshot. We're going to put the Holiday Hinoki and White Sage scent profile information on screen so you can read along. Uh, again, the scent profile is white peppercorn, clove bud, cypress needle, cedar bark, birchwood, Siberian pine, warm amber, crushed moss, and vanilla bean. And holiday hinoki and white sage is yet to be released, ghost of Christmas future. In 1982, the Japanese Ministry of Agriculture, Forestry, and Fisheries coined a new phrase that defined a specific practice of nature therapy, Shinrin Yoku, or forest bathing. The practice is exactly what it sounds like, spending time in nature without necessarily exerting yourself with a hike or more intense physical activity, and studies funded by Japanese officials have shown its benefit on both mental and physical health. It should come as no surprise then that one of the most prized forest dwellers native to Japan has grown in popularity outside of the island nation for its stress relieving properties. The Hinoki or Japanese Cypress is an aromatic anxiety relieving treat. Besides smelling fantastic, this may be just a hit of what you need this holiday season. May you have a relaxing and restorative shave. Did you get some of this? Oh, let us know in the comments below. I've got a little bit of a Santa beard. <laughs> I've been waiting for day one right here, December 14th. Let's have a shave. Okay, we've already done our pre-shave and our hot towel. Let's make this lather. We are using, again, the Holiday Hinoki and White Sage Shave Soap. This came in the advent calendar from Phoenix Shaving Boy. <laughs> this is an absolutely wonderful scent. Oh my gosh, absolutely beautiful. The way everything is combined and folded into place. Again, peppercorn, that, that comes through very, very nicely, but not overly so. And the vanilla bean, boy, that is terrific as well, as well as some of the other uh, ingredients and scent notes that we mentioned. Uh, absolutely fantastic. We have got our skull right here. Okay, and we're gonna go ahead and dump out that hot water. We've got the uh, Phoenix Shaving Guitar Pick right there. We're gonna use that to scrape out a little bit of this shave soap and mash that into the bottom and then get our StarCraft shaving brush. Yeah, about that much right there. Can you see that? We're gonna get the uh, StarCraft shaving brush and we're gonna go ahead and uh, Build a lather. Oh my gosh, this is fantastic. Man, and the hot towel is great. And I've got about uh, two and a half, three days worth of beard growth, as you can see. <laughs> I've been kind of putting the shave off to just, just for this first day launch. Absolutely. Yeah. Here's my, uh, my StarCraft shaving brush. Here's my Dreamscape scuttle right here. We're going to go ahead and, uh, build this. Oh. <laughs> That's marvelous. This really is a great Christmas scent. I, really, this is marvelous. 
Again, this is uh, shave soap of the future. Shave soap yet to come. Uh, so keep an eye out for this one. This is marvelous. Really, really nice. I'm going to need a little bit of water here. And I probably, I don't know, maybe I scooped too much. That's okay. I don't mind. Uh, this is uh, this is on my list. When this when this gets released, I'm getting a large tub of this. Absolutely, this is phenomenal. And the nice thing about the advent calendar is that I now have a travel size of both the aftershave splash and the shave soap. So if I buy the larger bundle. Uh, I can uh, kind of take a little bit out of the shave soap container and put it in this smaller one. It'll be properly labeled. And the same with the aftershave splash. I'm sure there's a way of transferring it over uh, and I can travel with it. That is, that's marvelous. That's really nice. A little more water. A little more water. Yeah. I really put in a nice size scoop there. Yeah. Oh yeah. Look what we got here. Oh man, this is this is a marvelous scent. It has a nice refined gentlemanly quality to it, but there is this masculine edge there that is just wonderful. And again, this is terrific for the holidays. I know that, you know, there are some Christmas get togethers that are going on right now, right around, right about, right, <laughs> right about now. And, uh, there's one in the neighborhood that I'm invited to. And I think this is what I'm gonna, this is what I'm going to wear before I go to it. I swear, this is ter this is terrific. Absolutely fantastic. And look what we got. Boom! Lather! Yeah, we're all set. Let's get right to this. Okay, I'll tell you what. Here. Let's, let's take this off. <laughs> all right? Here. Let's just, let's just, let's just take this off with a little bit of Christmas magic, okay? There we go. There we go. Okay, now we're all set. Let me just uh, wet the face here and we'll do our pre-shave lather. Okay. Boy, this is marvelous. I am just going to get to the shave. Uh, I already have the blade loaded, the Platinum Strings razor blade, in my stainless steel Ascension double open comb twist adjustable razor. So we've already got that set up and ready to go. And here's goes the lather. Oh boy, that's nice. And that's a nice, that's a nice warm lather too. Oh my goodness. That's fantastic. What, this is a, <laughs> it's a beautiful scent. This, this scent is not only great for the holidays, but it is wonderful all year round. And you do get that open forestry, open forest kind of natural, wide, you know, like you're surrounded by beautiful trees, you get that sense, you get that quality as well. This is marvelous. Wow. Oh, this is, this is touching all the bases. Really, this is really, really nice. Wow. This is a great scent to kick off the Advent calendar. The 12 Shaves of Christmas. This is a good one. <laughs> All right. Here is my uh, my razor. We're going to go ahead and we're going to open that up a quarter of a turn because I've got, like I say, two and a half, three days worth of beard growth. And you can see the balance and alignment. Spot on. This razor's phenomenal. I was deciding whether I should use my metaphor in brass or the copper... Ascension double open comb twist adjustable. I thought, you know, I haven't used the stainless steel in a while. And uh, it's a great razor. And it's stainless steel. It's a lifetime razor. Let's use this one. Oh, yeah. All right, here we go. 30 degrees, a light touch. Let the razor do all the work, gentlemen. Why oh, it's just really cutting through like a like a knife through butter. Like a hot knife through butter. Might have a little blemish there. I'll have to be careful.
CK6 is awesome. All right, I'm not going to rinse. I'm just going to go right to uh, pass number two because I know with this amount of beard growth, I'm not going to, I am not going to uh, be anywhere close to uh, socially acceptable. I mean, I'm kind of there, but uh, I can be honest with you. It's <laughs> I need to, um, I need to just, Go right to my second pass. I'm going to need a second pass. You know what? We'll gauge after the second pass. And I just dip the brush into the water there just to give myself a little bit of more water on that lather. Kind of smooth things out. Okay, let's go, let's go ahead and snug this up. And we're going to go about an eighth of a turn. All right. Pass number two, we're going to go east to west across the grain. Nice and smooth. Marvelous. Wonderful, wonderful scent. Great protection. Great lather. Nice warm lather again. Oh, that's beautiful. Really cleaning up underneath the nostrils very well. Thought I had something over here. I might have been mistaken. I don't know what that was. <laughs> All right, second pass done. Now let's rinse. I just need a little bit of a touch up. That's all I need. Boy, I think it's. I think the shave is done. Let's do just a little bit of a touch up, just to show you that we have. Uh, a lot of nice lather here. My gosh. And I'm just going to use that water that's on my face to kind of uh, move this lather around. Boy, that's, that's great. Look at that. All right. I'm just going to put a little more just gonna get scrape it off the brush a little bit, pick it up, okay, and then give myself a little more cushion, so to speak, here and there. Boy, these synthetic brushes are just wonderful, and this StarCraft does a great job of doing that. Again, all I'm doing here is I'm just scraping it off like this, and then picking it up and putting it on the brush and just moving it around on my face. Like this, where I need a little, or I think I little, need a little more cushion. That's what I'm doing. Absolutely fantastic, and that brush works quite well uh, in doing that. Here we go. I'm going to snug it all the way up. We're going to go past number three, south and north against the grain. Love, love, love doing a third pass. It's marvelous, marvelous. Okay, I pretty much got the upper lip on the second pass. Yeah. Yeah, got the, got the lower lip, that little, what could be a potential soul patch. I got that really, really well. So that's out of the way. All right, 
Uh, they're passed out. I'm going to do my rinses and get right to the alum block. I did my warm water and my cold water rinse. Okay. <laughs> Clean, fresh towel waiting for me right here. What a wonderful shave. Man, what a great feeling. This hair growth was driving me nuts. What a great shave. This is BBS. Oh, man. That's fabulous. All right, here's my alum block right here. This is the solid alum, solid alum block. I don't have the no slip grip on it. Uh, we're just going to go ahead and use this. But here's the no slip grip. I took it off, let it air out a little bit on the sides. Okay, that's going to dry out a little, more, a little more thoroughly on the sides. We're going to run this under some cold water. All right, here we go. Oh boy, what a shave. <laughs> that's nice. Uh, maybe one zing. Whatever I thought that was, there's nothing there. Couple of zings on the neck. But other than that, nice bracing and really, really just a terrific feel. Smooth as ice. That's really, really fantastic. Here's the uh, dry dock. There's the Allen block right there. Okay, that'll go in there. And I'm just going to set the, uh, the no slip grip on top there let me show you the lather <laughs> oh man look at that gosh what a great look at that look at that huh oh it's absolutely fantastic fantastic lather and the scent again is marvelous uh the mixture of the peppercorn and the uh vanilla bean and what else here do we have here the uh white peppercorn the clove bud, the cypress needle, uh, Siberian pine, that really, I think that comes through as well. And um, the crushed moss, probably a little bit of that in the background, but I'm picking up the vanilla bean, the white peppercorn, the Siberian pine. Uh, boy, it just blended so well. Uh, what a terrific, terrific, wonderful, wonderful scent. All right, let's go ahead and get this aftershave splash right here. Here it is right here. Holiday... Uh, Hinoki. Holiday Hinoki. Yeah, is that it? Let me just, let me make sure. <laughs> let me make sure. Let me get the, let me get the page right here. Yeah. Holiday Hinoki and White Sage. Uh, yet to be released. Ghost of Christmas Future. Right there. All right. Let's take this and set that aside so it doesn't get wet. Okay. Here we go. I, I probably shouldn't shake. Sorry about that. <laughs> okay. There it is. A little plastic restrictor there. And then we're going to, ooh, yeah. This is great. I'm going to put that on the hands, let that air out a little bit. Now. Oh, man. That's nice. You know what? When they release this, I'm definitely going to get the, uh, the star jelly with it as well. Uh, but for now, I'm going to use a little Mysterium Serum for upstairs. We did do a head shave the other day. So I'll put a little bit of Mysterium Serum up there. And... Because it's unscented, I'm going to add just a drop or two of this to give myself kind of a scented balm. Great, great shave. The first day, day one of the 12 shaves of Christmas from Phoenix Shavings Advent Calendar. Wow, what a great way to kick it off. This one is great. Again, this is a shave from uh, the future. Uh, <laughs> as they say here, uh, Ghosts of Christmas Future, yeah, shades yet to come, uh, Holiday Hinoki uh, and White Sage. Boy, oh boy, this is a this is terrific. Holiday Hinoki and White Sage. This one is great. A beautiful, beautiful scent. And of course, CK6 performance is absolutely spot on. So uh, keep an eye peeled for it. If you got the advent calendar, how did you like this shade this morning? Comment below, let me know. This was a great one to kick off the 12 Shaves of Christmas. All right, that's it. The first day in the 12 Shaves of Christmas. Check out tomorrow. We're going to open up another door. Day number two, December 15th. I'm really looking forward to it. The 12 Shaves of Christmas from the Phoenix Shading Advent Calendar. I'll see you real soon.